Hi, welcome to my movie review of the film Lawless. And uh, I'm just going to tell you a little bit of what the film is about. And uh, basically, I'm just going to read this off of IMDb. It says, Set in Depression-era Franklin County, Virginia, a bootlegging gang is threatened by a new deputy and other authorities who want a cut of their profits. So that's pretty much uh, what the film is about. So... If you're someone that's seen the the trailers and the TV spots and the stuff like that, and this is and this is probably one of my main gripes of the film, is that they they basically they they're showcasing it as if you know uh, Tom Hardy, Shia LaBeouf, and Gary Oldman. They're kind of especially Gary Oldman. He's kind of part of the main cast. Well, if you've seen the film or you plan on seeing the film, you probably need to know that Gary Oldman is only in the film for like maybe five minutes. At the most, he's he, he has a cameo, and that's it. And and you know, this is this is one of those films that sort of being. It's I guess I guess I see it as it's kind of it's supposed to sort of kick off this, uh, you know, the the Oscar season. You know, it's trying to this is a film that's trying to get Oscar buzz, that kind of stuff. And and that's why the you know you can just you can just obviously tell you know if you've seen the film you you could just there's there's all this stuff, but yet. Which I think that that's what really that's the main thing that hurts the film because it tries so hard and it falls so flat and just everything. I think I think the first half it starts off it starts off pretty good and then well not even the first half but there's 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 a little I'd say pal it's a little over a quarter into the film it just it just like it's like flipped a switch and then just boom just goes down just goes downhill right from there and it never picks itself back up in fact it gets worse and worse the performances you know it's got a great cast it's got tom hardy it's got gary oldman it's got Shia labeouf which i actually do think Shia labeouf's a good actor he just hasn't been in some of the best films lately um it's got uh guy pierce and jessica chastain and it's got uh, what's his name uh the guy from chronicle uh dan uh andrew i forget his name anyway that actor, I think he's actually, um, you know, so far I've only seen him in Chronicle on this one. He seems like a pretty good actor. Anyway, uh, I feel like all the all the talents just totally wasted in this film. I, you know, I, even you know, even Tom Hardy and you know, in Guy Pierce more specifically. You know, some people have actually said they've actually praised Guy Pierce, you know, because he because he's so over the top. I, I think he was. I thought he was bad. Uh, this is. This is his worst performance. This is this is the worst performance I've ever seen by Guy Pierce, and I think he's a pretty I think he's a pretty damn good actor. I think he's actually a great actor. You know, if you see Memento, you see how great he is, and he's just totally wasted. And, and, and well, in the sense that I just I just think it's bad direction. You know, they, you know, he's he's, it's so over the top, it's so overdone, and it just it it got on my nerves. It was. I, I, just, I couldn't take it. I, I, I really, it was really bad. I thought, and Tom Hardy, I, I another I, I, I thought was wasted. You know, he, he's, he's kind of. I mean, there were parts I was kind of like, yeah, that's, you know, that, that was, that was pretty good. But, you know, but there'd be other parts where he's like, he's doing the same thing over and over and over, and that just, I don't know, that just didn't work for me. And, uh, you know, given that, you know, he was just in uh, The Dark Knight Rises, given I thought, which I thought was an extra extraordinary performance you know an oscar rate performance uh this just this was bad you know to to, to tell you the truth and uh and, I, and at one time i thought maybe there would be some uh, performances that i thought would probably uh, or you know that that might get oscar buzz you know just by just by judging by the trailer i will uh, i think that's gonna happen and uh yeah this was not the best film to be quite honest with you, I'm kind of mixed because part of me wants to like it because it is it is original. It's not some, uh, it's not it's not it's not a remake or anything like that. It, this is fairly original. It's based on uh, a book called The Wettest County, or something like that, and it's it's. It's it's based it's well it says in the film that it's based on a true story. I'm not sure how much is is uh, is is fact and how much is fiction. I'm not entirely sure on that. But uh, the film looks great. You know that's that's one positive thing I could say. And 
Gary Oldman is uh, even though the fight, even though he's in like the film for like five minutes, I thought he was great. You know, if that's anything that's worth any kind of praise, it'd be him. But that's it, though. Really, uh, to tell you the truth, that's all I got from it. So, uh, like I said, I was mixed. I'm, I'm I wasn't sure what to give it, but I, to be honest, uh, I can't, I can't give it anything higher than a two and a half out of five. I thought there was some some decent stuff there, but nothing that really shines or even worth uh giving much praise to i do think if you are interested in seeing this film maybe possibly uh go see it as a matinee or something or just wait uh till it comes out on a blu-ray or dvd and just check it out then because i, I don't know i mean some people have loved this film and uh some people not as much i uh i've seemed to be on uh the other end the uh the the end that says, well, it's not that great. So anyway, uh, thank you for watching. Oh, and before I go, uh, I do want to mention, I did see a film. Uh, it was yesterday. And the film's called Bernie. And I, w I watched it. I just I watched it on my computer because I just decided to check it out. I wasn't sure whether to, to buy it or not on Blu-ray or something like that because I saw it. Anyway, uh, great film, fantastic film. If you're, if you're looking for a great film to rent or even buy, uh, I highly suggest Bernie. Uh, it's uh, one of the year's best that I've seen so far. Uh, Jack Black's in it. I know you know you might be thinking, oh, it's Jack Black. No, he's he's fantastic. He, um, I, I would I would go as far as say I would go as far as to say that Jack Black uh, deserves an Oscar nod for his performance as Bernie. It's it's a great great film. And Matthew McConaughey's in it. Another um, great performance. Just everything about the film. Highly recommend that film. Go check it out. I give Bernie a four and a half out of five. So. Uh, Go check that out, and uh, thanks for watching.